Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise today to commemorate the 75th anniversary of the founding of the State of Israel. 75 years ago, 11 minutes after David Ben-Gurion announced the creation of the new Jewish state, President Harry Truman became the first world leader to recognize Israel. Our nations have been friends and partners ever since. The people of Israel have won against overwhelming odds and repelled many attacks over the decades. They have not merely survived, they have created a free and prosperous society, becoming our most valued ally in the region. What they have accomplished is nothing short of miraculous. They have revived a dead language and rejuvenated agricultural, techno technology, and prosperity. And no matter what acts of terror or threats they face, Israel will always have the right to self-defense and self-determination. I congratulate her people for this anniversary of independence in their historic homeland and pray that they may be blessed with strength, peace, and unity for generations to come. And with that, I yield.